Hey, my name is Isabella Vitovich. You may know me from Wonder. If they stare, let them stare. Or the TV show, The Fosters. So, are you like into girls? Now you'll be seeing me on Veronica Mars, the newest season on Hulu. Line one, Ms. Mars. Thanks, darling. Uh, coffee. Black. My never miss TV show would have to be Friends. Really? I never miss it, I watch it every night. I fall asleep to it, it's my favorite. Are we gonna talk about what you guys did last night or? The moments within like every episode are just timeless. Like they're funny at any point, at any given time, no matter how many times you see it. In fact, the more you see it, the funnier it is because you know when those moments are coming. <laughs> Fine by me! It just never gets old. What is up with that? Kate Winslet in Titanic. The last thing I need is another picture of me looking like a porcelain doll. She was so like radiant and graceful, and I remember watching that whole film and just being like, I want to do that, I want to be on screen, I want to make people feel the way I'm feeling right now. So serious. She's a very empathetic actress, so anything that her scene partner is feeling, I can see like an ocean of it within her eyes, and I just think that's a really admirable quality. To making it count. Goodwill Hunting. Will, remember we went to kindergarten together? I have seen that movie so many times. How do you like them apps? I saw it the first time when I was really little, and I don't think I got it. And then a couple years later, I revisited it, and I was like, oh, this is fantastic. Thank you. And then now every time it's on TV, I watch it from beginning to end. Sounds like a real hoot. I also like cry in sort of ridiculous places. Like there's a scene where Robin and Matt Damon are just like cracking up laughing. <laughs> and it was all improvised. And I think just because I love Robin Williams, it just makes me cry now every time I see it because it's just such a brilliant scene and the two of them together are magic. Those are the things I miss the most. I would really love to make a film with Guillermo del Toro. One of my favorite movies of all times is Pan's Labyrinth. Um, I just love him as a visual storyteller. He can make you feel something. Even in the silences, it's evoking emotion out of you. I also would love to direct, so I think both as an actress and as somebody who just admires filmmaking, it would be a huge honor to, to work with him. There are so many reasons why people should watch the new season of Veronica Mars. You ready? Let's do it. There's a lot of danger, a lot of excitement. These bombings are part of a campaign to destroy this town. Tears, uh, laughs. Nothing a strip club can't fix. Excuse me? I think what's really cool is that it's gonna appeal to both old fans of the show and to fans that are just hopping on board and catching it for the first time. And you wouldn't think it by looking at her, but you know what they say about small packages? That you've got one? What? That was my take five, and now you can see me on the newest season of Veronica Mars on Hulu. Yeah!